Well, I'll tell you, I think uh, Doc, as everybody knows, is the grandfather of all super speedways anyway. And it's, uh, to me, it was, it was, uh, it's always been a big challenge. And in California, where I come from, it's about the only racetrack. That one in Daytona is the only one we'd ever really heard of. And uh, I, I really enjoy running down there. I think uh, I like running the Darlington as well as anybody else because of the challenge of it, I think. And uh, we've always managed to run real good there. And we were leading the race last year when, uh, uh, I guess, you make a little bit of a mistake and you hit something. Well, I did. I hit the wall. And so we finished back a ways. But I think, uh, I think we're going to win one of these days. And I believe uh, next Sunday is going to be it, I hope. You mentioned your home being in California. Is the racing there similar to the racing in this part of the country? No, th they don't really have any racing out there. What, uh, what I always run was in the figure eight cars and claimer cars. A uh, claimer car being a car that someone from anywhere out of the stands, anyplace else, can come down and buy for $199 at home. And uh, they run a little super modified stuff. and. Uh, but as far as stock cars, they just don't really have it out there yet. It's it's coming. NASCAR's got a, a circuit out there that that uh, they're getting some pretty good cars. Uh, uh, to be perfectly honest with you, I've never seen a Grand National car uh, uh, unless I was in it. I, I, I had never really seen a Grand National car until '69 when I bought the one, first one I seen.